Well, if this isn't one of the most diverse spin tires vehicle lineups we've had in a while, what is going on everybody? Tomcat here, and today we are on the map Pre-Runner Playground in spin tires with a Ferrari F12, a Lamborghini, um, crap, I completely, literally just forgot what that Lamborghini was. I am not even gonna lie. It's a Lamborghini Huracan. Why, why did I not know that? Why did the name Lamborghini Huracan slip, completely slip my mind, and I just, like, it literally was not even in my brain whatsoever. It was gone. It was 100%. I'm not even, I'm not even joking with you guys. It was literally 100% gone. Regardless, we have a Ferrari F12 and a Lamborghini, why does it disappear every single freaking time? Lamborghini Huracan. Okay. I'm good. I'm good, I promise. I promise it's not like 1 o'clock in the morning. Regardless, okay, so here's my plan. I want to see which one of those, the Hercules mud truck or the massive uh, Super Duty mud truck, I want to see which one of those is better for crushing cars. Now, in order to test uh, my, uh, in order to put my uh, curiosity to the test, we are going to line these cars up. Actually, not right there. We're going to line them up way further down. Way further down so we have room to get some speed. And we are going to legitimately... Like, we're going to we're gonna crush these things. We're either going to send them flying or we're going to crush them. One of the two. Going to try and get these somewhat remotely lined up properly. Grab the Huracan now. Oh, start up, please. Thank you. See, I remembered it was the Huracan this- that time, like... Like, not like it was that big of a, like, an issue, but jeez. Alrighty, I'm thinking we're gonna stick you on the other side of the F-12. We're gonna- firstly, we're gonna unleash the, um the Hercules on these two, and then, after that, we're gonna go, we're gonna let loose the, the Death Ford. The Death Ford is just, the Death Ford is crazy. Um, it's, it's, it's literally the Death Ford, and, like, you can't call it anything else. Really, like, nothing else applies. Now, this Hercules, uh, this Hercules Chevy, right, is a four-wheel steer menace of a truck, and it will kind of go anywhere. It'll go anywhere. It'll go through anything. It'll go over anything. Like, look at this. I'm gonna just dip it into this, into this, like, crater real quick. If I can get it up on the, up, well, if I can get it up over the edge. Come on. I'm trying to be somewhat careful with it. Put it into high range, and then you just literally lay on the throttle and it just climbs the rest of the way out, no problem. Although, the only, the only issue is, if you do it wrong, and you kind of pitch the truck improperly, that will happen. <laughs> that will happen, and that can be a little bit, little bit iffy when it does. But, I should have room to, are you serious? Not enough room to put it in a high, huh? Come on, truck. I just talked up a really big game for you, come on. Oh, okay. Damn. Alright, well, it was- it was basically out. It just kind of got out of line a little bit. But regardless, that's okay, because it's time to unleash this thing against these two cars. And, uh, and really and truly see what happens. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ooh. Okay, so it just kind of ran them over and just kept going. It ran them over, kept going, wasn't too dramatic, wasn't too big of a deal. I was thinking there's there's gonna be like one of two outcomes. It was either gonna be like that, or it was gonna send them both flying, um, which is a possible, which was a possibility as well. Which I feel like the Death Ford has a higher probability of sending the cars, you know, absolutely just careening off into the distance. Um, oh God, okay, that kind of well, your uh, your fender doesn't really exist much anymore. <laughs> for the Lamborghini, like, good god! Neither does the wing now, like... You wanna be hella flush? That, that, that's how you be hella flush. Or at least that's how you be... Well, more like hella dead. But no, uh... No, no, no problem there. 
Real quick, I'm going to park this kind of out of the way, and we're going to reposition the F-12 and the Huracan. And I'm thinking, honestly, you know, when we reposition these cars, when we reposition these cars, because this is not the only angle we're going to hit them from. We're going to put them at a couple of other places um, and hit them from uh, a couple different angles as well. But now that, mm, let's, let's set these, let's set it on, on the pavement just to, just to prevent it from going down into the ground. Because I don't want to, I don't want to have the, like, the outcomes be different just because one car, like, they were in the ground one time and then the other time they weren't. So that's kind of a, that's kind of something I'm trying to sort out here with these two. That should be good. Alright, death Ford time. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Dear God, can you go in a straight line? Possibly? Oh, okay. Well, that just completely... That, that destroyed the Ferrari. Kind of drove right over the Lamborghini, but that, like, but it absolutely destroyed the Ferrari. Like, the Ferrari is done. Absolutely freaking done. Parks, it square, parks itself squarely on top of the Lamborghini, too. Like, absolutely squarely on top of it. No big deal at all. No big deal whatsoever. In fact, in fact, where I want to put these cars next... Oh, man. Wait a minute. I have an idea. I have, like, a legit idea, and I don't know if it'll work or not, but it's kind of a, something along the lines of a car cannon, and I really don't know if it's going to work. I really don't. Like, it's, it's, it's a complete toss-up on whether or not it's going to work, but we're going to put one of these cars up here at the top of this ramp, right, and see if we can legitimately launch it into oblivion. Um, I don't know how far it'll go. But, and you know what, I was going to turn it sideways to try to get more of an effect, but I, it looks like I'm going to have to do it straight on, because it, it looks like if I try to do it sideways, it won't be able to sit up there properly. Alright, so we're going to set you right there. Are you going to really roll all the way back down? Come on. If I can maybe, there we go, if I can hang a wheel over the edge. Oh, that's not the view I wanted. That is not the view I wanted in the least. Uh, but let's grab the Hercules for this. Grab the Hercules for that, and then we'll go to the jump, quote-unquote. Get out of the hole, put it in high, and see what happens when we hit that Ferrari from behind. Alright, come on. What? Literally nothing. Like, legitimately, literally nothing. I'm kind of confused, actually. So the front... Our axle completely clipped through anything that that, that car would have had. This thing may, may have a different outcome, but I'm not sure. It... Oh, it, it pushed it. <laughs> Oh, the, the well, we pushed the Ferrari in, but we weren't able to save the Hercules from the depths either. Uh, oh, while we're here, while we're here, I'm kind of curious to see, hmm, if the if the Huracan can make the like make these jumps. There's no way in hell that's happening, if that's all the speed it can give me. There's no way in hell that's happening. Wow, that's dismal. That's really bad. That is really, really, really bad. I'm, I'm, whew, This is so bad. Okay, so, let's put the, oh, let's, I know where we're gonna put the Huracan. For strictly, uh, testing purposes. Because the... The, the the Chevy went right over it on the other jump, like the like the huge jump, the mega jump, went straight over it. But, but, oh wait a minute, huh? 
So let's have you right there, and I wonder if we can take the Hercules, take it over there, and do some sort of thing to where, some sort of challenge to where we cannot touch that Lambo. It has to just sit there. The, the Lambo has to just sit there, and we have to drive around the edge of that bowl. And in a truck this big, that's going to be really, really, really difficult to pull off. Oh god, alright, uh... We're gonna have to be in high range already when we drop in. Ah, uh, that's gonna have to be... Have to be a thing. Oh my god! Oh, we did it! I mean, we did one rotation, but we still did it, like, damn! That was awesome! Like, we still did it! And I'm pretty freaking pleased, but like, okay... So we know that the Ford can launch cars, the Chevy not so much, um, they can both crush them, the Ford I think is definitely better, uh, for that, but I think if I had to, if I had to pick one to take away, it would be, uh, it'd be this thing. The, the Hercules Chevy is just an absolute beast, but these little challenges are always really, really fun to do, um, if you guys have any ideas for little challenges like this, leave them in the comment section below, um, I will see y'all next time, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave it a like, tell us, tell it, the tell me in the comment section below what y'all thought of it, and if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe for more, I'll see you guys next time, talk Talk to y'all later.